Today is Batman Day. I picked up some other stuff that's not related to Batman Day. So I'll show the Batman Day stuff at the end of the video. Um, but yeah, let's talk about some things I picked up. I actually went into Target and I was going to buy a copy of Black Widow in 4K. And they didn't have the Target exclusive, which is what I wanted. So I just kind of like, eh, they only have one copy of the 4K. And I'm like, you know what, I'll wait. I'll grab it some other time. But they did, because they had Rocky Horror Picture Show, the Blu-ray, on sale for $10. Now, I've never seen this movie. Heard amazing things about the movie. Had it slip, all that. You know, that type of thing. Has a disc. There's digital code if you guys want it. You know, but I'm not going to use the digital code, but yeah, I, $10. Uh, this was like 15 for a while, 20, and then it was 13 on sale. And I thought about grabbing it when it was 13, but 10, oh yeah, I'll grab that. And then I saw this in Target as well. This is uh, the Toonie Terrors, which I have a couple of these. I have the Michael Myers and Freddy Krueger one, but this is the Jaws one. I also have the Beetlejuice one. So I grabbed the Jaws one. It was 20 bucks. Uh, I didn't even know this one was coming out or anything about it. It's just like I saw it in the store and knew I had to grab it. So let's get this guy out here. We got a little spear here, or a harpoon, or whatever, and they got a little knife there. And uh, yeah, let's unwrap this here. Unwrap, 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 unwrap. So I'm, come on. I'm trying to undo this twist tie here, so give me a minute. Okay. So there is Bruce or Jaws. Um, you know, actually, I believe in on the set they would call him uh, Bruce. Why does his tail not go on? It's interesting. So in the picture, it doesn't show it going on either on the back. So does it not go on? It's a like why do you why do you have the tail if it isn't gonna go on like? Shouldn't it be like that? Is that just like a display piece? That's really weird. Doesn't matter too much because it, it, he just looks like he's come out of the water. So maybe his fin isn't up yet. You know? And then you just put Quint here. Who, uh, you know, he's got a little right there in his hand. Give him a knife. Well, Quinty. Quinn had the worst death in the movie. It was like such a violent death for this character. And you should have had it. It should have had more impact. Like they should have focused on his death more. He just kind of died and went really quick. It was kind of sad because you love Quint in the movie. But he kind of had like the least impactful death scene in the movie. Did it just come off? Did his hand just come off? Don't tell me it did. Holy shit, his hand came off. I don't know if I'm going to... It looks like I should be able to get that back on. But I want to be careful about it because I don't want to break it, you know. There we go. Oh, shit. Okay, what I'm going to do here... There we go. I got his hand back on. It looks like this is the knife, the hand the knife goes in, and the spear goes in the other hand. That's probably why that came off like that, because it wasn't meant to go on that hand. Uh, oh. Nice, it's going to keep popping off. Hopefully that does not continue to be a problem, but... 
Nice, it just keeps popping off. Okay. Apologize, guys. Ooh. There we go. So there we go on Quinty. I might have to glue his hand back on. But yeah, there's Quint there from Jaws. And there's Bruce from Jaws. And there you look like they're about to get in a fight. And yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, 20 bucks, good deal. Pick that up. So then I went into my comic book shop because it's Batman Day. And I every time I go in there, I buy like a dollar issue of comics. You know, just like a dollar issue. So here's the one I bought, Star Wars one. Thought it was cool. Picked it up. Then I picked up this one, which is one of the free Batman Day issues. They were only allowing one per customer. So I picked up Batman Night Watch. And then I picked up this one here for my brother who couldn't make it because he's working. So I picked that up for him. So I'll have to give that to him next time I see him. But yeah, I picked that up. And then, of course, I plan to buy something on Batman Day because I'm not just going to take their free stuff. I'm also going to spend some money. And I bought this Batman Beyond Bruce Wayne bust for 30 bucks. Was 60, so I paid 30. Back in their display cabinet, they had one in there that is still, um, that was still like priced at $70. So, you know, I got a deal basically. Here we go. It's kind of like a little bit smaller and bigger than I imagined, but it's also very heavy. Like this is a hefty bus. Like this thing. Like this thing has some weight to it. Looks fantastic. If you haven't seen Batman Beyond, great show. And I thought this was a really awesome bus for 30 bucks. Of Bruce Wayne from that show and the show kind of takes place in like the future where Bruce Wayne is like mentoring a new Batman and um, it's a fantastic show and writing there so yeah I mean that's great uh, for 30 bucks yeah I picked this thing up I had to have this uh, I was thinking about grabbing it before and I was like yeah, just wait till Batman Day. You know, grab a Batman figure on Batman Day. It just made sense. So I waited, grabbed it, and this thing is awesome. Um, they have some other busts in this kind of line of DC figures that I might grab as well. But if I do, I'll, I'll wait a little bit. I might grab the the John Stewart one. Yeah, the John Stewart one. I always mix up which one's Hal Jordan, John Stewart. I don't know why I always do that, but uh. You know, I have one of the few thousand of these that exist. Amazing bus. Pick that up. 30 bucks. The deal. Because, again, that thing's usually a little bit more pricey for that. So, picked it up at a good price. Uh, you know, I got some cool stuff on Batman Day. Hope you guys had a good Batman Day. And I'll catch you guys later.